checking of the gold and silver. We know these are real. Yeah, there's Jay Smooth, my buddy, and uh, eBay guy, and uh, he's got uh, what we're going to do is I'm going to trade really good merch for this really good scrap right here. Bartering is the process of obtaining goods or services without the exchange of money. And he's got 14 carat, there's a silver dollar, there's gold, and some rings, silver. And we're going to make a barter because he's like a kid in a candy store right now. Yeah, this has already been. Uh, yeah, this is this is the top of the line of all the storage units I've bought in the last six months right here. Just stuff everywhere. And this is just one building. Building three. Jay's in here loving what he's seeing this time. He's digging into semi precious metals here. And he knows that he can grab what he wants in here. And as long as he's got enough gold, he's got everything in here. Doesn't have to spend a penny for it. Isn't that nice? Brass for the eggs. Brass for that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there was one unit I got a lot of brass in. I think that came all came from the same storage unit. Wow. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's it's the base. The table, yeah. That's the base to something. Yeah, I see there's a bunch of bases. Yeah. Football stuff. It's a belt thing. That's an accessory to something over there. I'm not exactly sure. When I played football, I never wore that crap. <laughs> yeah. like oh, it's for flag football? Like a streamer, I guess. That's it. It's for flag okay. football. So then this clips as your belt. Yeah, and that's it. And then you pull those flag. out. That's it for flag football. That's got to be it. It goes in there somewhere like that, but yeah. All right. Well, now we know what we got there. And there's like a ton more of the jerseys. I think there's different sizes. And some of those are already those opened are different up. different style. Yeah, that's a different style. That one almost looks pretty cool. Yeah. I mean, they're like the dry fit. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> style. Here we go, guys. We're pulling out merch left and right. We got war hammers. We got shoes. We got brass. We got vintage. We got old dolls. We got old cameras. We've got great clothes on hangers from that unit with all the Jordans. We've got Jordan. And we've got Jordans. And we got some freaking Jordans. And Jay brought me this seat for the motorcycle that I had traded him before in a previous trade. And this has got the this part, and we got the brace for it over there, so it completes this. So, bartering if you guys never consider bartering, here we're loading up shoes and shoes, and some more shoes, and some uh, video game stuff, yeah. and some costume jewelry, more shoes. Stuff and some stuff, and a whole look at all. Let's show them all the jewelry that comes into the deal. Yeah, it's full of costume right there. Yeah, I take care of my eBay guy Jay, man. He's a buddy, and uh, we've been trading for years. And we started going to auctions at uh, public storage caravans, and that's where we met. Yeah. That's when it was. 2000, I met him in 2000. Yeah. So. Uh, just started and have been doing this for about two months when we met. Yeah. Yeah, you were you were kind of new then. Yeah, I barely knew, and I was looking it on YouTube, and I'm like, "Are you sarcastic, Stagger?" <laughs> That's me, but I was I wasn't really very at all if at all famous, but yeah, I guess you had noticed me because uh, well, I typed in Louisville storage units. Yeah, and I came YouTube. up. It was one with uh, Jerry. Yeah, Jerry Step. Uh, uh, Jerry Green, right? Isn't it? You mean the, the guy that was a little older than me? Yeah, he like had the, the dreads, kind of. No, yeah, you're talking Jerry King, man. Yeah. Oh, okay. Jerry King and Jerry, yeah. they're two different people, man. I saw y'all both in the, in the video, and then like a couple of days later, 
But you're like, I got a unit off Bardstown Road, and I was like, he's in Kentucky. Yeah, and uh, that was the Jerry King was in that uh, video that day. We were look, he was looking at that unit that I bought. And yeah, that's been so. I've known you now for five years. Yeah, so we've been trading ever since. Yeah. We got the EOS on the wall. EOS. Cannon. On that was on the wall. Oh yeah, I've got that camera, but it only films ten minutes at a time and it shuts off. Yeah, here we are loading up some of the stuff. He's got all the clothes from that unit. Y'all remember where I got all the Jordans? And he's buying the the shoes and some war hammers and some random stuff. You guys probably remember this. He got some of the old dolls that I had, those creepy dolls. I finally unloaded them. Thanks, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Take them all for just, just take them all and uh, give me a little bit of money. I don't know <laughs> something. And then Jay got the he got my uh, uh, brass, which is good. He can turn that to money real quick. And we work pretty well together. And uh, so here we are doing our regular transaction. He gave me gold, and uh, we uh, we gave him some mold, gold for mold. No, that's actually good stuff. Yeah. All right. So here is the deal on our bartering today. My eBay guy, Jay Smooth, brought me $1,000 of gold and silver scrap. In trade, I gave him Jordan shoes, video games, tools, Warhammer figures, dolls, comic books, gas leaf blower, and other random merchandise. We do this a few times every year. It's win win for both of us. So, you other resellers, find someone to barter with on some of your goods. You just might start to like it. It's time to find you a story unit in your area. Everybody that watched this to this point, <sighs> come by Storage Auction Insanity, our live stream that we do on storage auctions, and we will help anybody that comes into our chat that wants to try buying a storage unit. We will find one in your area. All you have to do is give us your zip code, and we'll profile it for you. And we have a lot of fun on this show, and I'll show you an example of that here in one second. But uh, thank you for uh, watching the video. And make sure you come to Storage Auction Insanity every Sunday, 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We have a bunch of fun with Glenn and Joy of the Storage Bandits. A while back here at Storage Auction Insanity, we had Larry on our show. Larry is a great member of our community who came on our live stream with some epic plans. Larry had been dreaming of this for some time. He came onto our show with some nefarious plans. He went to the grocery store the day before the show and bought ingredients for a cream pie. He showed up on time for the live stream and he was ready to kick off his plan. We talked for selling and what sold and what items to be on the lookout for and out of nowhere, Larry slammed a pie directly into his face. <laughs> He ground the cream pie so hard into his face his nostrils and ears filled with the pie he baked for this show. Come to find out Ham's beer was involved in this decision by Larry L.L. Stash. He hasn't been back since, but that pie slam into his face sent shock waves all around the reseller community. When confronted by the show's host about slamming and grinding that pie into his face, Larry replied, I didn't slam a pie into my face. I slammed a pie right in my fucking face. Top that cowboy. That's right. <laughs>